Adlu is having their Cotton Fest. And here to tell us more are Brindy, Crystal, and Bergen. Thank you all so much for being here today. Yeah, thanks for having us. Well, this is exciting. This has been going on since the 80s. Yes. Best music. Okay, that's that's just me. All right, tell us, <laughs> tell us about the Cotton Fest. Yes. Yeah, so you're right. The Idaloo Cotton Fest has been around since the late 1980s. Um, it took a little bit of a break, but um, our committee brought it back in 2017. So mm -hmm. this is our sixth annual. Um, we're really excited to be here, and the three of us are all Idaloo graduates. So it runs deep in our family. Our parents, grandparents have all been a part of Idaloo Cotton Fest, so anyway, we're excited to celebrate. Absolutely. So we've got a parade going on. Tell us a little bit about the parade. So the parade is super fun for kids, families, whoever wants to attend. And um, We start at the gin, come down the frontage road, and then end back at the gin. Um, our theme this year from our shirts, you can tell, is our town, so it's pretty much anything Idaloo, green, gold. Um, it's fun to see all the horses. People bring horses, people bring their bikes. Um, a lot of the football teams are out, the cheerleaders, and then um, a bunch of the local businesses will do floats too. So it's always fun to see what they do. The churches do. Um, just really, there's a, um, the car show will come through and there's uh -huh. a bunch of cars. So anyways, it's just really fun. Well, the name is perfect. It's our town. That's who you will see in the parade. Right. And of course it's open to the public, anybody and everybody, because you got a lot of activities besides the parade. Tell us about some of that. We do. So after the parade, we go down to our county park and we have food vendors and booths with food trucks. Then we also have a uh, barbecue cook-off that's sponsored by Jackson Brothers. And then we also have a car show. We have live entertainment which all of them for the most part are um, idly natives or they go to school mm -hmm. so it's a fun field entertainment we have um, Bondi Bonds I don't know if you have heard of that in Ryman Ryman Shack tell us about yes. that so there are going to be food trucks out there um, we have about six or seven a little bit more coming out so mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, I won't say too much of the yeah. food trucks so <laughs> I'd be excited but we have all kinds of food out there booths from jewelry, from shirts, to teach mm -hmm. Um, mm -hmm. just different things. So it's fun and exciting. So bring your lawn chairs out if you want a f um, good entertainment. That's right. And also you've got sponsors, but you're also looking for some sponsors. Yes, um, anybody that wants to sponsor the Oddly Cotton Fest um, would be happy to use it towards our event. We also have a uh, street dance in the evening, so we use a lot of the money towards the dance. Um, the band Double Shot will be there. Um, we'll have Old Rusty's Barbecue Truck there. The Snow Cat will be serving snow cones. So it's a kid-friendly event. Um, we also uh, raise money for Cotton Fest King and Queen, and it's two of our seniors at Idaloo oh, that fun. we give a scholarship to. Oh, love that. So it goes towards a good cause yes so food parade food parade and, and you goes to a good cause yes. tell our viewers where they can get more information to plug into this event and um, so we have a Facebook page it's Idaloo Cotton Fest or you can call me and ask any questions and I'll direct you where to go great well thank y'all so much and congratulations it runs deep how fun is that that's small town our town right there That's so thank right. y'all for being here and sharing more with us thank, thank you, you. Thank you.